Hey guys, welcome to another lunch review. Today I'm going to try this new Campbell's Well Yes Soup. Um, this one is the roasted chicken with wild rice soup. Um, corn, carrots, and sweet potatoes. So that's kind of what it has in it. These were $1.99 at Kroger. However, I got this free because it was a free Friday. So I just want to tell you that up front. Um, chicken meat with no added antibiotics. Non-BPA lining with can, I guess. No preservatives. There's something you can read. Okay, so uh, one cup or about two servings is 110 calories. It's 245, so it would be four, 490. I wonder how much it really is. 490. Um, it's a little less than two servings, so it's actually it's actually less than 220 calories. So, so that's not bad. So to make this, you can do it. Um, I'm gonna do it in the stove because I am at home today. Um, so I'm gonna actually got home early. So you can put it on the stove top and just heat it up on the stove, but you can put it in a bowl in the microwave, which if I was eating this at work, that's what I would do, but that's what you do. Um, heat it in a covered bowl for two and a half to three minutes and then um, let it sit for, for a minute. And I usually stir it up once between that time too. So anyway, I've got my pan here. I'm gonna put it in. And I do like the fact that it has a pop top lid. So that makes life easier if you are eating this at work. And I'm gonna have to be right back. I can't open it with one hand. Yeah, there's no way I would have been able to open that with one hand. So, lots of soup. I have a cat talking to me behind me. Okay. There it is, there's the inside of the can. If you care. I use a spoon to get the last bit of that out, but it looks pretty good. Lots of corn. Looks like a lot of corn, but uh, it's supposed to be roasted chicken, which I did see some chicken in there. There's a piece right, right there's a piece of chicken. So I'm going to get this in the, uh, on the stove and once it heats up, I'll be back. Okay, right, this is hit off the stove top. It really doesn't look any different than when it went in, but I put it in a bowl. So uh, I'm going to let it cool off for just a minute because it's very hot and steamy and uh, I'll be back. Okay, it's had a little time to cool off. It's probably still pretty hot, so it'll probably end up burning me. Um, there's chicken, a carrot, a corn, a rice. Food, of course, chooses this moment to get out. Who knows? Anyway, here we go. I tell you what, it has some pretty good sized punks of chicken in it, too. And that's one of the pieces of chicken in there. And it has some pretty good pieces of carrot. The carrot I got was a pretty good sized piece of carrot, but it was good and soft. It was well cooked. Um, the chicken was good and tender. The flavor reminds you of a, of a chicken noodle soup, honestly, or a, a chicken a chicken vegetable soup, maybe, if that makes sense, but not a really thick one. It's a very runny um, soup. I like the flavor of the wild rice too. Overall, the flavors are okay. I forgot to look at the sodium on there. Um, these are not as, as flavorful as a lot of the other soups, and that could be because of the, um, maybe they don't add the fat to it or the sodium to it like they do other ones. Um, so I'll I, I have to look now just for my own curiosity, but you guys saw when I showed it, but uh, I just don't remember. So anyway, the uh, the flavor of this is okay. It's just kind of, it's kind of bland. And you know, I say these are carrots, these might very well be sweet potatoes. They don't taste like carrots. They don't taste like a sweet potato either. So, it's probably a sweet potato. Uh, regardless, it's very soft, very mushy. Uh, it's not, not hard, so that's a good thing. Nothing in here is really firm. The, um, the chicken has a really good flavor to it, though. It has a good texture. So anyway, overall, I think it's a little bland. It could use some some pepper or some salt or some seasoning in there, but um, but overall it's an okay soup. So I'm gonna give it a three. Um, not the best soup I've ever had. It needs some spice or something in there. Um, but if it's healthier for you, I guess it's a good thing. And for 200 calories or a little bit less than 200 calories, that's a pretty good meal. So I hope you enjoy this video and thanks for watching. I want to give you a quick follow up. I ate it all, drank it all. Um, the soup part itself, when you turn the bowl up literally and just slurp it. 
um, it was really good. That was the best part of it. The rest of it was still pretty bland. So I haven't changed my opinion. I'm still going to give it a three. I wanted to follow up with the sodium. The sodium is basically for the entire can is right around 1200 milligrams of sodium. So it's still really high in sodium with all that sodium. Where was the flavor? I don't know. I don't know. It was bland. The chicken was okay. The rice was really the only thing that gave it a lot of flavor. Um, I don't know. I, they, they could have added some, some pepper or something in there. So again, bland, but the sodium is still pretty high. Uh, don't know the, that this is necessarily any better for you. I guess it's a little bit better, but um, a little healthier, but calorie wise and sodium wise, it's definitely not any, any healthier for you. Fat only, there's only one gram of fat though in a serving. So two grams of fat total in the whole can. So that's not bad. So, um, and uh, 16 grams of protein in the whole can. So that's pretty good too. So anyway, catch you next time.